Hello guys, welcome to another Warframe video. Today we will talk about all the different ways to get energy in Warframe. Not all methods work while using channeled abilities so make sure to pay attention. We'll also tell you prices and farming location for all these methods. Ok guys so let's get started. Energy Siphon is an aura mod which regenerates 0.6 energy per second. As an aura mod, the effect is shared by all squad members. Even after stacking 4 of these in a 4 person squad we only get 2.4 energy per second. As you can see energy regeneration here is pathetic. You can get this mod from Nightwave Cred offerings. The aura mods in here rotate every week. Xenuric Focus School is the most widely used method for getting energy. Max Rank Wellspring provides us 5 energy per second for 30 seconds. Energy Pulse provides us 50% extra energy from energy orbs over 5 seconds. This method provides us with good amount of energy per second. You can only use this method when you have completed war within quest. It doesn't work while using channeled abilities. To unlock the Xenuric Focus School, just equip the Focus Lens on your max ranked Warframe. Depending on the type of Focus Lens, they convert ranging from 1.25% to 3.25% Affinity into Focus. These two mods called Rage and Hunter Adrenaline converts health damage into energy. These mods works best on tanky Warframes which doesn't usually gets one shot and have low shield value. You can also reduce your shield using Decaying Dragon Key for some quick energy builds for ESO. Usually people use one of these due to modding space but, they stack together for 85% health damage to energy. These mods work even when using channeled abilities. Both of these mods are tradable and cheap, costing around 5 to 10 platinum. Hunter Adrenaline can only be farmed during Ghoul Purge Bounty or Plague Star event. Rage is dropped by these enemies. Rage mod is also transmutable whereas Hunter Adrenaline isn't. While using these mods health damage will give you energy. You can use Life Strike. That way you can regenerate health using heavy attack with your melee. Life Strike is a pretty common mod. It costs like 2 to 3 platinum. Next method is using energy pads. These squad energy restore provides 4 energy pulses every 7 and a half second for total 30 seconds. In steel path mode there is a 60 seconds cooldown after using one. In normal mode you can use multiple energy pads. There are three kinds of energy pads. Small which provides 100 total energy. Medium gives 200. And large gives 400. You can get blueprints for these energy pads in energy lab, dojo. Just replicate blueprint from here and build them in Foundry. You can't use them in some missions like SO, ESO, Index where you can't use gear equipment. Energy pads don't work with channeled abilities. Next method is using Equilibrium on your Warframe and Synth mods on your companion. It works best with Panzer Volpafila as it gives us damage boost using Viral Prox and Energy too. Synth Fiber allows us to pick health orbs even at max health. Synth Deconstruct helps us generate health orbs. This method works quite well in missions. This method also works with channeled abilities. It works really well as you can see. You can farm Synth mods in Fortuna Bounties and Equilibrium mod from Lephantis Assassination at Demos. Stay tuned for the second part, in which I will share some more ways to get energy. Thanks for watching, kindly like, share and subscribe.